can you tell me how to get to Sesame Street? Let's sing along. Sunny day, sweeping the clouds away. On my way to where the air is sweet. Can you tell me how to get, how to get to Sesame Street? Come and play, everything's a-okay. Friendly neighbors there, that's where we meet. Can you tell me how to get, how to get to Sesame Street? It's a magic carpet ride. Every door will open wide. The happy people like you. Happy people like what a beautiful. Dot dot dot. All right, so this is Sesame Street ABC. There's two games in here. Let her go around. Ernie's big splash. Um, I actually hold the world record in both of these games. Let's get right into it. 1989. Um, this is a high-tech expression game. Let her go around. Uh, I guess we got to do all these. Um, interesting. Let's do some uppercase matching first. So we gotta match the letter G. Um, there you go. That's the letter G. Now I gotta match the letter E. the letter B. I messed up there. Uh, that's the letter E. I gotta match the letter P again. There we are. That's it. That's the letter P. And then we get the dancing big bird. My favorite. You know, it's a, uh, to be honest, The background and everything, all the background tiles are actually very nicely shaded and colored. They just look very nice. So I guess we'll just wait through this uh, animation here. Oh, we already did this one. Okay, lowercase matching. A little bit harder. Let's see if we can get them all on the first try this time. I have no clue what any of those letters were, I just matched the shapes. All 
All right, enough of that. Mixed case matching. This one gets me a little a bit nervous here. A. I know that one. You really only got one in a one in twenty six shot there, so can't go wrong. I think that's a letter U. And we have a letter K. We got a uppercase. This I was promised mixed. Oh. I believe that's Bert. And um and Cookie Monster. Without a cookie. Nice big sprites. That's what I like. Uh, one little word. Fur. Starts with an F. Then a U. Watch out, don't get any ideas. It's only a three-letter word here. And an R. What do we got? Fur. I know that's Bert. The other one's a smaller guy. The shorter, more corpulent uh, human question mark puppet is Ernie. I believe this is Bert. I gotta do the whole fireworks? Alright. What's missing? Well, there's hat, there's gat, there's tat, a tit for a tat, there's eat, there's rat, uh, <laughs> I know it's not A-A-T. Let's go for hat. Good guess. Ooh. I'm going to go for bar, which is where I'd rather be right now. I'm just kidding, I'd rather be here playing uh, Sesame Street games. Uh, dig Doug, I'll say Dig is more of a certain choice than Doug. Though Doug is certainly a word, past tense. Once again we got our, we're just gonna skip this. Uh, spell the secret word. I don't give you any help here. Let's see. There's fog, as in forget about it. There's jug, as in jugget about it. There's hog, which I have a feeling it's hog. <laughs> no, it's not. Jog? Fog? There's so many choices. Hog? Uh... Is it jog or jug? Let's go with jugs, because who doesn't like some nice jugs? Nope. I think it's Jog. Or is it Joe? This game makes you think. 
Of course, jog, what every kid should be doing for a healthy activity. Instead of playing video games. Fantastic. I think that concludes our letter go round, right? Whoops. There's no <laughs> there's no escape. Oh look, you can speed up the Um, alright, we're gonna have to reset, which sometimes messes up the Elgato, but, oh well. Nah, I think we're good. Ernie's Big Splash, let's do it. Uh... We're going to start with Ernie's Challenge, then Ernie's Fun Challenge, then Ernie's Super Challenge. So this is the regular boring one. Um, we have a, uh, a few nighttime maritime sceneries, and then just a pipe. Uh, we have to get the water. to the bathtub, but let's do it in just a crazy convoluted way, right? <sighs> Interesting. It doesn't go back and forth. Every button does the same thing. So if I skip it, I can't go back. Oh boy. Oh, ah, went too far. Game's not easy. And look, the rubber duck takes such a uh, such a journey to get to where I am. Truly incredible. But Rubber Ducky, you are the one that makes bath time a lot of fun. Of course I... oh, there we go. Press select to go back. I like these little chess pawns right on the side there. Let's go, Ernie's fun challenge. No. I believe this one, we have to go through Grover. We're just going to go a way, way convoluted path. Just to maximize our duckiness. Let's see if we can get every single... Let's make this a slow run. Every single brick. Can we get every brick? No, we can't get every brick. Oh well. Let's see it. Let's see this voyage. Whoa, crocodile! It's a little too scary for kids. But it's nice they had a crocodile in, in the sprite catalog. That's cool. Didn't have to find that one out for ourselves. Seal with a ball. Another crocodile. And of course, Grover completely indifferent about the fact that a, um, a rubber duck has just passed right on over him. I feel like this is the global guts of Sesame Street. 
the rubber duckies just kind of have to traverse this guts-like course, leading up not to an aggro crag, but to a bathtub with some random dude taking a bath. Okay. This is the last one. Ernie's Super Challenge. Let's do it. Um, what makes this a Super Challenge? I don't really know. Let's see... We can't fill up all the squares. That's impossible, as you can see right away, because Ernie's in the middle of two open squares. But we'll try to fill up as many as we can. We'll try to get some, like, different ones here. I noticed uh, there's, there's a cloud and a pipe that both go straight up. I don't know what that one does yet. We already did the boat. What about... We already did the bubble. I guess you only have a bubble and a boat to go right. Let's do another bubble. And let's jump off, dive into the water. Ooh, ooh, let's take the pipe down. Oh, no, let's just fall from the heavens. Swing back around. Go up through Grover. Dive into the depths again. Down a pipe. Past the seal, past the bubble, dive into the deep, and there we return to where we need to be. Look at this. I just... What is that? Gum? Sewage? I don't know. Clouds? Bubbles. Hey. Okay. Clouds. I like when he goes up the cloud better than when he goes down. Shamu! Whoa! Killer whale. Back to back. I planned that. An indifferent Grover. What a journey. You know, and what a good way to cap off this wonderful game. Sesame Street ABC. Because um, as far as I know, there's no extra hidden features unless we want to do the sing-along one more time. Um, and that will conclude Sesame Street ABC. Um, Two fun games for the price of one. Uh, you know, I, I couldn't think of a more uh, meaningful way to uh, have fun on the NES. Family fun. Just for everyone. I'm going to stop the stream because we, we beat this game. Um, and then we will commence right back up in a literally less than a minute with um, Sesame Street 1, 2, 3. The exciting uh, sequel and then we got one more we got a third surprise so don't go anywhere we'll be back